Hi everyone, today I'm going to take you through what I ate on a fast 800, fast day at home. Um, I usually eat three meals a day, even on a fast day, but lately I've been skipping breakfast and lengthening my intermittent fasting to 16 hours, so no breakfast for me. <laughs> Instead, at about 11, I had brunch. I like to have eggs if I'm breaking a fast late in the morning and today was no different. I'm making a smoked salmon, asparagus and eggs meal and I'll link the recipe below so you can check that out. So after blanching the asparagus for a couple of minutes, I start preparing the eggs and here it looks like I'm doing a great job cracking the eggs with one hand, but actually I'm just getting egg whites all over my hands and I had to wash, pause and wash. Um, and then I added a touch of milk and I whisked it, whisked it all up or whisked. I still didn't get that right. Anyway, then I put a little saucepan over a medium uh, flame just spray a little bit of oil in and then pour in the eggs and then just cook it, you know, just stir it until it's scrambled. I usually take it off just before it's fully cooked because it just keeps cooking. And voila, look how quick that is. Amazing. And that's it for the eggs. And so then I just pop that on um, on the plate with the asparagus um, that I cooked before the eggs. Um, and then... The last bit really is the is the um, smoked salmon. So this was a hundred grams here. So I just cut it in half, and then just plopped it on top. So it was fifty grams of smoked salmon, um, which I love. No one else in my family loves, but I love it. I think it's awesome. So that other fifty grams will be for me later on. <laughs> and then um, and then I just added a bit of salt and pepper, which I can't do with one hand which is why I did it off camera. And that was it. And then I think I ate that faster than it took it to cook. So the next meal for me was dinner. Um, I had this at about six o'clock. And after looking after my son all day and showing loads of patience, this was a good release. You may notice there's a little pink splodge on the side and that's Play-Doh, which I noticed after I recorded this video, which was awesome. Um, so yeah, so you just smash down a couple of those chicken breasts. I, I made two, one for me and my husband. Both my kids had eaten already. And it looks like I've managed to crack pepper on my own, but no, no, my husband's there to help. Bless him. Um, and then you can see how super fast I am putting some tomatoes on top. I find this easier than wasting most of a carton of posada and I feel it's probably fresher so yeah pop some tomatoes on top and then extra ham for my husband because you know chicken's not enough and then um just some black olives and then um feta cheese which I crumble on top this is what it looks like when most of the cheese gets actually on the chicken not on the side and then the last thing to add was um just a bit of parmesan cheese just grated on top extra cheese for my husband he's not fasting obviously and then into the oven for 15 minutes and then like any good cooking show this is what it looks like afterwards so I was pretty happy with that my big thing is to have as many colors on a plate as possible well, that's what I teach my children and anyway it doesn't always work but you know so that one is for me so I just had some steamed veg and salad on the side um, and then for my husband, he had, you know, the extra goodness on top and I just made some pasta for him as well. But apart from that, it's the same. So it's quite easy to do when you've got one person fasting and, and one not. So yeah, so that one, that one's quite a good one. I've got this recipe on a blog post as well. Um, it must've been on a day when I had three meals a day because in the, recipe on the blog post it's only half a chicken breast but same thing so after dinner I had about 600 calories no 700 so I had a few to spare so once the kids were in bed at about 7 30 then I stole one of their <laughs> one of their ice cream well it's not ice cream it's frozen yogurt and it's about 80 calories tastes great good sweetener for the end of the day so that's worked so there was 780 for the day which is good for a laugh here is why i do voiceovers or music 
So easy to do videos with the family. Anyway, please do subscribe or check out some more video links below. Thanks for watching.